Number 25. Sacalina carcini. Sacalinus enters a crab, matures, then emerges as a large sac beneath the crab. It's able to control the hormones of the male crab, making it look and act like a female. Number 24. Ophiocordyceps unilateralis. Ophiocordyceps starts its life under plant leaves where it grows into a predatory fungus targeting insects like the carpenter ant. After the infection, it erupts from the ant's head to scatter spores and infect other ants. Number 23. Anisacus simplex. The nematode Anisacus causes a parasitic infection in humans called Anisacchiasis which targets the gastrointestinal tract. Number 22. Wolbachia. This bacterium infests more than 70% of all invertebrates in the world. To reproduce, they attach themselves to the female eggs where they're transferred to the next insect generation. Number 21, the Chigo flea. Also known as jiggers, this type of parasite, which is known to be the smallest type of flea, finds its way to a mammal's feet and eats its tissue. Number 20, Hymenoepimesis argyrophaga. These parasitic wasps lay their eggs inside their victims, and upon hatching, their children consume the host. Number 19. Vandelia serosa. Apart from infesting other fish by attaching itself to the aortal arteries in fish's gills, this parasitic pencil catfish is also able to infest humans who are fond of urinating underwater. Number 18. Trichomonas gallinae. This protozoan is a common and nasty enemy to birds. Infected birds of prey suffer serious lacerations in their lower beak, throat, and mouth. A severe infection will eventually starve the victim to death. Number 17. Sandfly protozoans. Skin leishmaniasis is the skin disease caused by the sand fly bite, but a more serious infection can lead to anemia and even enlargement of the liver and spleen. Number 16. Simothoa exigua. This tiny parasite targets red snappers by entering the fish and eventually ending up at the base of the victim's tongue. Here it digs until eventually the tongue falls off and is replaced by the parasite itself. Number 15. Trypanosoma. The trypanosoma parasites are carried by the tritomid kissing bug, pictured above, and are released in the feces deposited on the skin of the host. The parasite then penetrates the host and disseminates throughout the body. Number 14. Toxoplasma gondii. This is a common parasite found in humans and other warm-blooded animals. Within infected infants and people with weak immunity, it can lead to the fatal illness called toxoplasmosis. Number 13. Cochleomia hominivorax. Also called the screwworm fly, this parasite lays its larva on warm-blooded animals' exposed flesh. When the maggots hatch, they burrow into the flesh of the host while feeding. If the wound is disturbed, the larva buries deeper. Number 12. Horsehair worm. The horsehair worm infects insects via stagnant water and once inside grows up to a foot long, feeding on the insect's tissues. Number 11. Filarial worm. Besides the West Nile virus, mosquitoes also carry filarial worms which travel to the lymphatic system and are responsible for the condition known as elephantitis. Number 10. Loa loa. The loa, also known as the eye-infesting worm, penetrates the body through the bite of a deer fly. They wander under the skin, staying in the bloodstream during the day and infesting the lungs during the night. Number 9. Clostridium perfringens. The Clostridium perfringens is a nasty parasite that causes the condition called gas gangrene. This devastating condition literally melts your flesh into fluid and kills you within 12 hours. Number 8. Blood flukes. Also called flatworm or schistosoma, researchers rank the infection caused by this parasite right next to malaria in terms of infestation. Number 7. Oncocerca volvulus. Once it bites a human, microscopic larvae break through the skin, mature, and reproduce exponentially. Over 100 million microscopic worms invade every part of your body, eventually causing blindness. Number 6. Neisseria meningitidis. Being infected with N. meningitidis causes blood to stop flowing to your limbs which makes your limbs rot and your pulse literally non-existent. It also adversely affects your mind and intellectual capabilities. Number five, the tsetse fly. Tsetse flies can transmit parasites that cross into the nervous system, leading to confusion, sensory disturbance, and poor coordination. Number four, the guiana worm. The guiana worm enters the body through water fleas ingested from stagnant water and can grow up to two to three feet. Upon maturity, the worm burrows to the surface and exits the body by creating a blister on the human skin. Number 3. Plasmodium. 
The Anapahelys mosquito carries the plasmodium parasite responsible for causing malaria. It attacks the liver until it infects the red blood cells, leading to decreased blood flow, which can be life-threatening. Number two, Naglaria fowleri. This brain-eating amoeba lives in warm bodies of water. Early symptoms of infection include fever, headache, and vomiting, and if not treated, death can occur within 7 to 14 days. And number one, Leucochloridium paradoxum. The Leucochloridium paradoxum is a devilish parasite that targets snails. The parasite works its way to the snail's eye stalks, altering its look and behavior in order to appear and act as a green caterpillar, thus attracting caterpillar-consuming birds, which is where it does its real damage. If you liked the video you just saw, then feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel by using the orange button in the top right. And don't forget to go check out our website at list25.com for more awesome lists.